Buoy Health Insights, Upper Leg Pain. Hello everyone, and welcome to another informative video on Buoy Health Insights. Today, we're diving into a common but often concerning issue, upper leg pain. We've all had those days when you might need to skip the squats at the gym or even opt for the elevator over the stairs because of leg pain. But what could be causing this discomfort? Upper leg pain can stem from a variety of conditions, such as trauma, systemic disease, or inflammatory conditions. If you're experiencing pain in the upper leg, common characteristics may include discomfort while standing or walking, inability to put weight on the leg, bruising, discoloration, or bleeding, sudden sharp pains, and lingering pain among others. These symptoms are signs that your leg's bones and muscles, which are essential for a myriad of daily movements, may be under strain. Understanding the potential causes of upper leg pain is crucial as they can range from overexertion to indicators of more significant health issues needing medical attention. Traumatic causes can include muscle strains, bruising from direct impacts, breaks or fractures in the femur, and cramps when your muscles are fatigued or your body is dehydrated. In some cases, upper leg pain results from systemic diseases like tumors that may limit mobility or vascular issues affecting veins and arteries, leading to conditions such as varicose veins. Inflammatory causes relate to autoimmune diseases, which affect nerves, especially in the lower back. This category includes spinal stenosis, a narrowing in the spine that puts pressure on the nerves and spinal cord causing pain. Infections in the bones and tissues of the upper leg may also result in swelling, redness, and pain. Let's take a closer look at some specific diagnoses. Myralgia paresthetica is a nerve condition causing numbness, tingling, or pain over the upper outer thigh due to a nerve being compressed as it passes under a tough ligament near the groin. Visiting a primary care physician to confirm the diagnosis is important, and treatment usually involves rest, physical therapy, pain medication, and sometimes corticosteroid injections. Spinal stenosis is another condition that can influence upper leg pain. Here, Imaging of the spine and treatments like medications or physical therapy might be necessary, with surgery as an option for severe cases. Repetitive movements can also lead to strain injuries in the quadriceps or hamstrings, which, while uncommon, are important to recognize as a potential cause of upper leg pain. Patellofemoral pain syndrome, known as runner's knee, is another condition caused by overuse, especially if there's a misalignment in the knee joint or a previous knee injury leading to pain during exercises such as running or climbing stairs. Now, when should you seek medical care? If the pain is sharp and debilitating, if it persists and doesn't improve with home treatment, or if the pain is accompanied by other concerning symptoms like severe swelling or color changes in your leg, it's essential to consult a healthcare professional. Remember that while this information serves as a guide, it isn't medical advice and all conditions and symptoms should be evaluated by a healthcare provider. Before we wrap up, don't forget to like and subscribe for more health insights and tips to keep you informed and proactive about your well-being. Take care of those legs, and we'll see you in the next video. Stay healthy!